Alrighty guys, so I have like, as you guys seen, obviously the pictures and everything I've inserted. Uh, Indiana was kind of fun. I obviously did not uh, film while I was, um, hold on, I'm cleaning up garbage just left on the front porch. I did not film while they were giving me the tour because honestly, A, I forgot. But all you have to do is just, uh, look up gosh in college and you'll be able to see everything so the tour was uh amazing and people everything there were like super nice super sweet all of that um and the sooner i fill out my fafsa information the better well the sooner i fill out my fafsa information and finally get my application to them sent uh, the sooner I will hear back from them on whether or not if I got in. So, yeah. I am so excited to finally fill out my FAFSA. I'm going to take the bathroom trash out because it needs to be taken out badly. Um, so, that is going to happen next because it's going to be, it is full of shampoo. It, all right. So... We're just putting everything away in the bathroom, but this is my little folder I got. And then this is the little baggie that I got. I kind of put what was in it in my junk drawer, but I still, well, I haven't really finished anything. I was just kind of taking a little break because I still have to put my hairbrush and comb up. And I thought I was going to get a nosebleed because my nose started opening up. But yeah, so I'm still, like I said, still currently putting stuff away. And I got some stuff from my college dorm. Um, which I'll go ahead and show you because I got to put it in my closet anyways. Uh, I got a couple of things. I got a little waffle iron. And then I got both of them in the same color. And then I got a mini sandwich maker. So I can make like grilled cheeses with this. So, I'm excited about that. And then I got a book and a mag, two books and a magazine because there was honestly nothing to do at the hotel last night. So, yeah, now with the waffle maker, I can deliver today, which I have to do laundry Thursday. So, the shirt's in my uh, hamper, but I got this class of 2022 sign for me to do senior photos in and thought I could take it as a good like little prop because I am having a photo shoot with a professional photographer on September 12th. Paid for that myself so I got this little sign to do a little senior photo shoot. But no I did find out though that they do not assign you a roommate. They you basically feel like a fill out a roommate application form, and then they base your roommate off of like what you like, like your personality, how clean on you, how clean are you from a scale of one to ten, and like what you major in. I'm gonna go ahead, and then I have some like I said, there is garb. Ooh, don't fall. There's garbage to be taken out, but I did get one book, which I'm taking with me when I moved to Arizona. It is from Liddy a Fixer Upper. She has a cookbook. And then I did get this book too. It's about like horse trainer, like falling in love with somebody. Love it so far. And then I still have yet to re read this magazine about uh, small bios. So I got a couple things I can read. And that, and then, yeah, so, I am basically, officially, halfway a Gaussian student. I'm so excited. I am so very excited and stoked for this uh, next chapter in my life. So excited. Literally going to go out and celebrate when I get in, because this is my dream school. So, on a, so this is my dream school and that, so very excited. Room's pretty much straightened up. I do 
I have a lot of errands to run tomorrow, so like that is an issue. Like I have a lot of errands to run tomorrow, like I said, so that is kind of a big issue for me right now. Because I have to well first I have my nail appointment at 9 30. And then gotta run and pay a car payment. And then because my car is almost at 155000 I almost, I mean, I'm a little over 151, but I have to take my car, basically a four to five hour, four and a half hour car drive to campus. And then I'm going to be flying home on the weekends because I'll save on wear and tear on my car. So... Like I said, it's gonna save on wear and tear on my car doing it like that. So I am getting a new car. I'm not gonna be getting one until I turn 18 if I don't find one before then. But I'm waiting until I turn 18 because there is still one more 